In this video, we're going to be going through the steps needed to get you set up with MicroCloud for the first time. So what we're going to do is go to the sign up page. And then we're going to click Let's Get Started. And here we're going to sign up. So we're just going to put in some details here. and just pick the country that we're in. How do you plan to use My Quick Cloud? So this is just to give us some more information to help you at a, at a later stage. Uh, so for most people, they want to access or share specific desktop applications remotely. Uh, for instance, QuickBooks or something like that, you want other people to be able to access those. Uh, or you want to maybe set up your business as a digital workspace, but it doesn't really matter what you put here. It's just a bit of information to help us, to help you in the future. So I'm just going to pick this option here. How did you hear about us? Again, really helpful for us, uh, but just put in uh, however you heard about us and uh, subscribe to our newsletter would be absolutely brilliant. But then we're going to just click create account. Uh, not going to worry about saving that just yet. Okay, so here we need to decide whether or not you want to access this computer that you're currently working on remotely, or if you want to access a managed cloud server. So you might want either to set up your own, you know, use your own on-premise computer, or have us create a managed cloud server for you and, and, uh, and to set you up with access for that. If you're not sure what to do here, just uh, click help me choose. But if you're looking to get set up with our free trial, then just click set up now. Okay, so now the download is starting, as you can see down in the bottom left here. If you're using something like Firefox, you might see at the top right instead the uh, the, the download, but uh, I'm in Chrome, so that's down in the bottom left there. So I'm just gonna click that. Okay, so that's just started to install. So we're going to leave that to get itself set up. Okay, so when asked, um, do you want to allow MicroCloud to make changes to your device? You want to click yes. This just tells Windows that you're happy to allow MicroCloud to run as the administrator. Um, and that's to, to be able to have it work when you're logged out and things like that. So just click yes, and it will finish off the installation. Okay, so here we're just going to restart the computer and then when you've finished, log back onto your computer, go to microcloud.com, log in and you'll see your dashboard. And that's it. That's all the steps you need to do uh, to get set up with MicroCloud for the first time.